All right, so here we are on our walk to uh, the abandoned mental asylum, St. Crispin's. We are currently heading, I'm here with George, obviously. Hey, what's up? Hello. Uh, we're heading to the pub, uh, Sunnyside pub in Northampton, just to eat a bit of um, brunch before we head out, just to obviously fill ourselves up, give us a bit of energy. Hope you guys like the trailer that I put together yesterday. Today is the day where we uh, record. Hopefully we don't get chased out by people like we did yesterday. Um, I'll explain more going into detail after the video. Um, other than that, guys, we'll see you at the uh, asylum, yeah? Yeah, see you there. See ya. Alright, what's up guys? We are here at the asylum. Got my little gear piece on. Got my hoods on, my gloves. Right through there. You can there. You get, you have to get on there to get in. Climb the, climb the wall. Uh, so we're going to go in there in a second. And I will get back to you when we get in there. See you on the inside. Right guys, so pretty much we've just walked through this path down here and we're going to climb up there where George is. So yeah, let's get climbing. Let's go. So yesterday when we came in, there were some guys here, some chavy geezers. Do you want me to get in first? Yeah, sure. And this is where we found to get in. So, drop down here, put my leg through, and then squeeze in, we are in, okay I'll grab your bag, that's it, go on George, nice one lads, there's your bag. Alright, let's go. Let's not get chased out by any goons today. Yeah, I hope not. Because uh, that was... I don't know. Did you hear those dogs? Oh, that's bright. Did you hear that? This is the place. Yeah. Don't want to be too loud just in case there are people here. Alright. This. This is where we heard those boys last time. I jumped across there. I'm going to reenact what happened. So I jumped across here. And then we heard people through there. And I went around there. And yeah, let's just keep an ear out, yeah? To hear if we can hear anyone. But like I said, go around that way. Is there anywhere we can go? Can you do a double check? Because if there is somewhere to go. We can run round. George is just over there. So we came in here. Yeah? And we got chased out from over there and we heard people, so I jumped across here. And we kept going. You know what's eerie to me? You know what's eerie for me? Those those curtains up there. That's exactly. Look, it's creepy. It bro. Imagine looking at those curtains. Nah, don't. Don't even scare me, bro. That is... George is gonna do a bit of filming. Um, I'm gonna cut this to a new clip when we get inside, because we just want to scout the area before we do anything. See you in the next clip.
Nada. Nada. Did you see that person? Did you see that person? Walk out? I think so. I saw him. Right, so we're back out. Basically. I uh, nearly stabbed my hand through a fence. Um, we went to go in the building, the main building, which George was calling through. No word of a lie. We saw two legs uh, walk from the doorway. So we're going to go back in. Uh, we're going to sort of maybe reason with the person who has there and see if they're okay with being there to capture some footage. And if they are, we'll let them mind their own business. But we're going to go back in. And if I manage to get in without having to escape again, then um, I'll catch you some more footage and I'll see you on the other side. Right, whoever's in there, reason with them, so if we can record, and if they're fine with it, then cool. If not, then we leave. Get ready to pelt it. Hello? Hello? Right. That was the, that was the, yeah. right, from the right, from that door, someone walks across and I'm not f***ing doing anymore. Right, right, it's basically a little explanation of why that just happened and why this jump cut is added into the video. Um, we didn't actually see anyone. I thought I saw someone, I think my head was just playing tricks on me. Um, so of course we launched, ran and then got out because if we got caught you wouldn't really know what would have happened. Um, and George was pretty much just telling me, right, so we can go in, if there's anyone there we'll shout and you know ask if we can do some videos and clips. Uh, we did, there was no one in there, so the rest of the video is just a breeze from now. So yeah, back to the vid. Laura, if you just go in the area, if there's anyone here, 
però ovviamente è parte di questo livello no, remember I think I'm going to have to own it I may have been the tap owner to come and attack this corner because at the end of the day it's not hard to get into that but the tap will get in it's going to help but I'll take the corner we're going to try to pick it up okay, unless Unless you're not plank there. Yeah. Unless maybe I just thought that was someone walking that's, out. That's what I'm thinking. I'm, when, when I'm pretty sure I saw something, when but like. You're going to start thinking things which aren't happening. Yeah, of course. It's paranoia, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Someone would be in there. It's a bit bedrooms and that, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, it's a bit bedrooms. Yeah, no, it's not far. <laughs> I was paranoid. Yeah, I know. So was I. Yeah, this is nuts. I 
Sono le grandi. Te li segui? No, la pizza è su piano. Eh? Ah, sono le grandi. Dai, te lo dico. Dai, te lo dico. Dai, te lo dico. Check, get out of the grounds. You got a day on the grounds. These grounds. No. Wow, this is amazing. Yeah, don't, you know what I'm saying here? Huh? Um, what are they working on here though? Oh, great. Okay. That's nice, isn't it? Alright, there's a doorway. Don't worry about that. More stairs. Where's the bell tower? Going upstairs. Yeah, get right on the roof. Don't go upstairs. Easy, I understand. Yeah. Go look at the ladder though. Where's the tower? Oh, on our right. The tower's there. I hope we can get there. Yep. We might be climbing up that, so I'm excited for that. Yeah, we're gonna have to get inside. How's that? The guy in the hive's jacket was right. What's that, man? Satan's proud of you. <laughs> right, Someone turned it into a happy place now. Oh, but we need to get that way, so we might as well go down them stairs to the bottom, behind, because we need to get to the bell tower. We're going back the way we came. <laughs> oh. No, no, I'm not saying it's cut, I'm saying it's cut. It's high, very high. Look, there's a guy. Oh, oh he's looking right over. No, creep here. Go back downstairs. Wait, come this way. Oh, well, yeah, just stay in the window again then. where we came from down there. George. George. There's a cat. 
Oh, there's a ginger cat. Uh, huh? We'll see it when we come out. Yeah. Yep. Well, it's, a, it's not a black one, it's a ginger one. Yeah. I'm going to stand on the edge of that. Oh, wait. Oh, the guy with the his jacket. He's looking, he's looked directly at me. We're going down before we get caught, bro. Please mind the stuff. I'll just go to the barn so well, we he can't get this across. area of deception. So go down that way now. It's just going to That'll be fine. So what I'll do is I'll turn the torch on behind you so you can see in front of you. Is it that one? Uh, it's, I think the it's the next one. The next one, yeah. Yeah, look down there, that's how it's got. It's got some of these dark ones. This is my old one, don't you? You know, I've closed my head to that little thing. Oh, yeah. Well, we can't get through, can we? Is that what we came through? Yeah, you see that area? Yeah, see it? Yeah. Right there, sweet. Ouch. Hold on. Shit, my fucking camera. Oh, you got a torch. Yeah, no, no. Why, why are you saying hold on? You can't get through. I just told you. I'm saying there's a good thing. Okay. Check we can get videos on. How did you get down? Not really. Come on, off you go. There's two of them. Yeah, someone sat down there and had a few beers. Oh, you have to send the water out of the crowd. Look. What? You don't have to. Well, that's a way out. No, we, we can't get through now. Yeah, we can't get through. I don't think they're even at the door. No, I need to touch them. Well, back we go. 
That's dead cool. So, sadly, we ended up having to walk all the way back through that same tunnel because we came to a dead end full of wires. There was like water up to ankle height and obviously we weren't going to go in there. So, as you see here from the clip, we walked all the way back um, and then I end up going through this little tunnel again back through here and then all I hear is a smash and George is on the floor uh, scrambling so he fell over uh, but we got back and then we proceeded to the next building yeah. Pardon. <laughs> I'm saying like I burped on him. <laughs> I'm burped on my ass. Hold on. Hold on. Right in the house, in the floor. So just run it. He's not going to catch us. Milk your granddad. Can you look out for me? He's there though. He's there. He's there. George didn't, so I look like a twat. <laughs> Where's wasps in that in here? Right, you ready? I just want to get to that tower and climb it. Let's go, that's my main objective. He can get round here, so we need to creep round here. <laughs> We've gone in the main building, now we need to go to this separate one. <laughs> Look at that old fashioned turret there. Our way up. 
If I fall, I'm dead. No, because I don't know how I'm going to get round. No, the tower's through there. No, I need to come back down. Yeah, because we need to go through that doorway over there. Mm -hmm. Oh, Sides, grip the sides like this, that's all your tension. Um, and that's it, when you get to the top, if you want to go for it and stand on the edge, you can. It is a big drop, so I warn you, careful. So he's going up now. I just went up and that was scary. It's a lot bigger than the one we went on with dad. Um, I'm gonna quickly take my camera off to explain myself. Um, I'm sweating, basically, we came in, we thought we saw two legs walk next to us, I've ripped my glove, because I impaled my hand on the spiky fence, um, George is now out there, as you can see, behind me, um, and we're going to climb this clock tower behind us, is that you? You whistled. Why whistle? Oh, fuck you. Get down. <laughs> I know, just slip. Hold. It's hard, but hold. Keep your feet placed right. Your feet's placed right. Careful. That's it. Perfect. Now go down. If this is scary, just slide. Slide down. You can just jump this last bit. It's scary, isn't it, though, coming down? That's it there. Yeah. Oh. So maybe we do. Yeah, it's there. You're telling me people? What did you hear? It's up there. We walk up there. <laughs> I guess. Oh, well, this is just a crap moon. Let's try it. Remember, lean back like the lamppost. Is this sturdy? Can you hold this? Oh. 
Right, so it turns out that we climb this plank, and then at the top, as you see there, that plank that that ladder is standing on, it's not even a ladder, actually, for starters. It's like a drying rack thing. And what that, um, what that thing is, it, what George is stepping on now, is what I stepped on, and it nearly flipped, but I didn't manage to get that footage, and it deleted off my camera. So we got across that gap, tried it, and I tested out that, and everything nearly fell into the floor so if you just keep watching we end up going back down out of the building and then into the next building and that's all what happens so we tried climbing the clock tower but turns out there was no way to get up because if we went on the ladder we would have fell about 50 feet through the floor um, so yeah we're going to explore around this building, I'll show you some footage, do some pans, and then yeah, do that.
came from over there. George is there. There he is. There's a yellow and green marked police car there. Um, I don't think they can see us. But there's windows all around where pe people live in these buildings here and here. So don't, wouldn't advise myself getting caught. But there's not much else to go. But that don't matter. There's nowhere else to go. <laughs> Right, should call it an end then. Right guys, well, we'll meet you back um, at the fence where we got in. And yeah. Right guys, so um, we're out, we made it out. It's behind this building here where we went. You can see the little spire up there. Um, that was a very interesting uh, trip. I want to get the camera out of the sun. Bit of a um, roller coaster, yeah. Bit of a roller coaster. So we got really scared because yesterday um, we got chased out of the place by what well, sounded like two guys. Mm. Um, they might have been just as scared as us. Uh, but we've gone back there today, and this is the video for you. Uh, I basically what footage I didn't get was this leg that I saw. What we did is when we went in for the first time since since yesterday, you heard what happened. So you. We didn't see anything or hear anything, right? Yeah. And then we went to go in this doorway and uh, George heard footsteps and I saw two legs in mm. grey trousers come out. Well, what I thought was two legs. Yeah. Now, I think it was probably just the curtains which were ha hitting because yeah. we didn't know what they sounded like. And then later on, we were like... And later on, we realised there, yeah. there was no one there. So, of course, we ran off. I escaped only just piercing my hand through the fence, which was a bit stupid. Uh, it's only a little cut, um, no worries. Um, but I got gloves on luckily, my probably alert my fingers are disgusting because I fell through <laughs> a tarmac floor. And I went down there. To be in there. We weren't we weren't even meant to be in that area. George yeah. um, me and George were just jumping over this gap and uh, I went onto this tarmac floor. My right leg, I'll try and show you, um, there is all dirty. My right leg went straight through the floor down this uh, massive drop, so. I crapped myself. George, I George got really away. scared. Because he, he thought I was gonna just fall all the way in the floor. Yeah. No, I grabbed myself before mm. I fell. I was like, I know how I'm gonna get back up. Mm. Um, so yeah, that was a bit crazy. Um, but we had a good time and we're happy that we did it. Um, the next place we'll be going to is another place in Dustin. Don't know what it's called, but we found an old factory. Because look, there's cracked, look, I'll show you through here. There's cracked windows, there's a camera there, as you can see. There's a cracked window there. And I don't think the building's being used. So we're thinking probably about coming back. And sort of quit and we just stopped here. But look, there's an open window up there, look. It seems a little bit... Um... It seems risky. But look, if you get in there, that'd be easy, bro, at night. Mm. Um, and then after that, I'll be doing a point of view rooftop run that we're going to be doing in the town centre. So stay tuned for that. Yeah, I'll explain more about it when I'm back home. And yeah, thank you for watching. See ya. Don't forget to like, subscribe if you're new. Click that bell icon here um, to not get notified when I make a new video. Right, see you later guys, peace.